So, you know, the new little animal, the new, new addition to the family, the unicorn. Are you ready, girl? Yes. You sure? Yes. Okay, let's so do this. What's up, Divas and Divas? It's your girl, April and Mumsy. And we are back to do a Dollar Store haul. Dollar Tree haul. Yeah, same same thing. thing. Bye, Rick. I pull your heartstrings brick by brick, make you love me. Hey girl, let me build you up. Play an optimist, let me fill you up. Hey girl, this is definitely love. Hey girl, let me build you up. Play an optimist, let me fill you up. Hey girl, this is definitely love. Brick by brick. What's up, Divas and Devos? It's your girls, April and Mumsy. And we are back for another Dollar Tree video, right? Mm -hmm. So, Mumsy has started school, so we are going to be showing some school supplies. We already did buy some stuff, some things, but today I was there alone. Well, not really alone. I was with my other daughter because somebody was at school. She left me. It went back to school. So I had to go without her. My Dollar Tree diva buddy right here was not there. But I had just a good time with Nay. So first things first, Mumsy is going to be 10 this month on the 16th. So uh, what did you get for your birthday? It was a surprise. <laughs> it wasn't really on my birthday. Too. Okay, yeah, well, it was for it was your birthday. Friday. It was on Friday, but it wasn't for her birthday. But it is for her birthday. I got my phone. So she's got her first phone, right? Mm -hmm. So... Now she can text me. Mumsy is what I call the sweet texter, right? Because she sends you good night emojis, good night, sweet dreams, good morning, my sweet. Like, she's the sweet texter. Then there's the mean texter and what the rude texter, the annoyed texter, the forgetful texter, the slow texter. I'm probably like, what am I? I feel like you're the slow texter. <laughs> no, I answer back. To people that I like. But sometimes, like, you have trouble spelling some words. It's my nails. <laughs> I ain't got no trouble spelling. I just have a problem <laughs> with my fingernails. So, I, it takes me, yeah, I guess I would be the slow text. So, well, Mumsy texts me. I'd be happy. <laughs> so, my text messages to her would be, like, sweet, right? <laughs> My sex messages to you are sweet. <laughs> yeah. Okay, cool. Anyway, we are going to go ahead and start this Dollar Tree. Then we got something at the end of this video that we wanted to share with you guys. But we also wanted to let you know that all of the fidget spinner winners will be receiving your fidget spinners by the end of this week. They were already mailed out today. We actually went ahead and got five more fidget spinners. So instead of it being 20, it was 25. So you guys, the first 25 people that responded via email to me and Mumsy's um, giveaway you will receive your fidget spinners by either Thursday or Friday. So first things first, we did go to two stores. You guys already know how we do. We like to go to two. We did, we had like we an adventure. We went to, we went to three. That's right. You right, see? But the one store, I don't even think it's like a chain store. It's just like a regular, it was dollar something, right? I think it was privately owned. It was just like a privately owned person and she just had everything in there dollar. But the stuff was good. It was definitely for a dollar. Make me holler. Wasn't I happy when when I asked yes. how much it was? I was, right? I was like, Mosey was like, no, this is a dollar. I was like, no, it's not. They just say dollar. There's nothing in here that's a dollar. I told you this is a sticker on. I know. I was like, when I lay, oh, you guys, wait until we show you guys. I mean, like, maybe to interest some of you guys that got kids, but... I was like blown away. So we all first start off with the Dollar Tree. So we went and got some school supplies or I did without my girl. Some of these dry erase erase markers. These are required now for the fifth grade. Um, and they're really inexpensive at other stores. But for one dollar, you can definitely get your fill of them. But do they last a long time? I mean, the ones that you got me that were just black from Dollar Tree, they didn't last forever. Like how long? Like when you say forever, like one week really yeah but these ones are pretty good though these ones are good mm -hmm. only a week yeah, only a week but these ones are better mm -hmm. okay so these ones here are definitely better so mumsy suggested these the other one was a five how many were in the other pack so ones that only lasted a week there were four in them and they only lasted a few like a week. 
one week. Was it the same brand? No. Okay, so it was if, like a cheaper brand. A cheaper brand. If you um, come across these at your Dollar Tree, this is the Studio Art. Definitely pick these up for your kids if you need some dry erase markers. Mommy said that these are really good. Did you forget to put the caps on them? No, the ca I put the caps on them all the way on all the time. Oh, that's so so Mumsy needed. She told me she needed some fine um point fine line markers. Now we did have some already, but she said um that it was fine. I didn't need to get her any. But I figured markers dry up really fast, and because we out here in the desert, I just think that they probably dry up even faster. So I went ahead and got two packs of these from the Dollar Tree. You'll get twenty different colors for a dollar. <laughs> Can't beat that for a dollar. So I decided to get two packs because hey, they're only a buck. Were you not really gonna go wrong with buying two packs? Normally, if you go to Walmart, these are a little bit more expensive. So I just decided to get two of them. And the good thing about them, if you have little kids and you want to give them markers, they're washable. So they are washable markers. These aren't for Mumsy, but these are for my grandson because I cannot come home without anything for him. That's just like a given for me. I always gotta make sure that I find something for him. So great activities. Yeah, right? I well, they're non-toxic, so they're non-toxic. So crayons are non-toxic, so these are ages three and up. Like, he does like to put stuff in his mouth, <laughs> but um, and he will put a crayon or two in his mouth, but thank God that they're um, they're non-toxic, so they're not going to hurt him. There's 48 of them. They say there's a built-in sharpener in this box. Those things never work. They don't. Oh, man, they never worked. When I was a kid, they never worked. So, I mean, these are not the best crayons in the world, but for a dollar, for 48, for a two-year-old, they're good. Me, personally, I I would prefer to only use Crayola because the consistency mm -hmm. and the that's color is better. better. Yeah, they color better. But for somebody that's two and a half, these will work just fine for him. And then we got him this big, giant color and activity book. So he don't have to color on my tables. He can just color in this, but, um, this book. So I don't know about y'all kids, but Mumsy loved the mechanical pencils that you push down. So when I seen these, I was like, oh, I'm about to get these for her. These are super cute. They've just got a little bit of patterns, but I have never seen a pack of 10. See that? Ain't they cute? Uh -huh. They're mechanical pencils. Those are cute. I know, girl. They got 10 in the pack. And see, we was at Walmart last night, and you only get five for two dollars. So for a dollar, for ten mechanical pencils. Now, me personally, I don't really care for these too much. I'd rather have a regular pencil that you put in the sharpener. I feel like they're, they're just better. What these? Yeah. Then the pencil, the real pencils. Yeah, because they're just they're better. Anyway, I'm gonna just ignore her. <laughs> I got these, and I also ended up getting these mechanical. Oh, I have those ones. These? When'd you get these? I got me those ones. I have them. When? For, school. for this school year? Yes. I be no, forgetting, I girl. I be forgetting. Those today. Okay, well, they're like cute. Them. They got lipstick on them. These are dumb cute, like for real, these. Isn't that cute? You guys can see it. Little hearts and. French fries and lipsticks and makeup and stuff. And burgers. Burgers. Dogs. Yeah, they cute, right? So some of these gel pens. And they wanted these. They cute, right? So you get six different colors of gel pens. And there is orange, yellow, green, purple, red, and blue. Um, I mean, you're not going to have these forever. Don't expect them to be the best thing in the world because you're getting six of them for a buck. But I'm pretty sure that you will make these work. They're great for school supplies. School supplies can cost a lot. When we was in Walmart last night, trust and believe, we tried to go to the Dollar Tree, but we did not know that they closed at 8 o'clock on Sundays. Oh, mad. You talk I was the ladies. What happened? I called the ladies. Oh. <laughs> I was kind of peed off because she was standing at the door, the lady who works at the Dollar Tree, and I was trying to get, she was like, we're closed. And I was, I was that mad. Yes. I was so stupid. In the A word after that. But she didn't hear me though. I mean, I hope she didn't hear me. <laughs> yeah, so we went to Walmart and it was so crowded. Like, I have that's the only time I really see Walmart really, really crowded like that is when it's school supplies. The, it's the seniors oh my school. God. No, just all the students are in there. And it's like, oh my God, I hate going there during that time. And I really should have just went before that. And I did, but I realized that I didn't get everything. So that's really why I tried to go to the Dollar Tree to avoid Walmarts. But it just didn't work out like that. I was, we got some of these colorful index cards. 
cards. These are really great. Nay got these. I love the assortment of colors. You get 75 of these. Um, they do carry all different sizes. These are great for projects, taking notes or whatever. My daughter's going into the 10th grade, so I'm like, time goes it by so fast. fast. Look, look to do you said the same thing. I picked up these really cool gold frames because I am like redecorating my home. And some of my things I just repurposed and redid like with gold spray paint. Some things I did go to like Ross and TJ Maxx and buy frames. I really do like fancy frames. I'm very picky, but I don't need like a ton load of those $10 and $20 frames. So going to the Dollar Tree and getting something like plain to just kind of like mesh in with the really fancy ones works out just fine for me. And for a dollar, these are really really nice right like they're thing. sleek and the color of the gold is very pretty and classy looking you can either hang them up on the wall or you can set them on your table because they do have the kickstand and like I said I never leave the Dollar Tree without getting anything for my grandson I always end up picking him up some tattoos because you know he's like a little muscular he's got this little muscle <laughs> man thing going on so I did get him some of these Paw Patrol stickers because he loves Paw Patrol his favorite um, character is rebel which is the little bulldog and then also i did get some of these from mumsy because she likes tattoos but she likes like burgers and french fries and stuff like that and these are glitter tattoos so i ended up getting her some they got um donuts watermelon oh yeah look oh look there's a bacon oh you love bacon oh the sushi i didn't even know that was a sushi cool ice cream and same things on the back so these were new ones though they're so cute uh-huh um i got another one of these two one foot files this one is actually for nay because she wanted one this actually isn't the same one that i got she got one like pink. mine is pink but it comes with a brush a pumice stone like three does it come with a brush yes it's in your shower right because the handle my handle is different so actually there are different types of foot pumice stones at the dollar tree there's this one that has the um razor the metal edge on it and then on the opposite right. side is the stone but then there's another end to it where it has the brush no it feels actually good your feet have to be wet in order to use this uh -huh. So if you like soak your feet or and you're in a bathtub or you're taking a shower, that's what you do. You can't do it. It'll hurt, girl, if you do it before your feet is dry. Girl, you be having like some... Girl. Ooh. Yeah. See, these work, though, because my feet is dry. You know my feet is dry, girl. Just like your elbows. And I be moisturizing my no, feet up. No, I'm not going to use that for my elbows. Anymore. No, you can't use this for your elbows. <laughs> you will mess your elbows <laughs> But you just, just use some lotion. You be good. For my buddy right here, because you know, she was uh, too much. Oh, I'm throwing shit. I'm sorry. But anyway, for my buddy right here, because she was not with me, and these were at the checkout. So these are actually emoji straws. And the face doesn't do anything, it's just that it's an emoji straw, so you have to have a face. Isn't it cute? Cute, right? You can make it like a just give it like a little cap kind of. Oh yeah. Like a small cup. Oh, maybe that's well, if it, it would it that would be cool if it was for a small cup. I mean cup, it's but, stretchy. Yeah, but that's a lot of stretching. That that that's a lot of girl. <laughs> it was really cute. I thought it was cute. Um, this little emoji straw because you guys know Mumsy loves the emojis. Oh, and we seen the emoji movie, right? We went to see the yeah. emoji movie. When was it? last thursday it was kind of cute I, I was i sat there and was watching did you like it it was kind of cool oh. for my grandson because he loves chapstick um i did get him a two-pack of the dory chapstick i really couldn't find anything boy boy related that is blue so. I, yeah but i wanted to find something like a paw patrol and i couldn't so it's just a two-pack of some chapstick and he lip balm and he loves you know lip balm he's always coming in here going <laughs> like a weirdo so i got him that and then i just got some for in the house whoever has dry lips because you cannot have dry lips dry feet and dry elbows like girl you be all tore up i'm saying oh hey girl um i wanted to try these i've never tried them before but it's two in one toothpaste and oh. mouthwash cleans teeth what? and freshens breath icy blast whitening i don't Is really know no it's two in one 
I don't know. I think if you take it all off, it makes the packaging look ugly, right? So it just looks like toothpaste. It says toothpaste and mouthwash all in one. I guess maybe the germ fighting stuff that's in it, but it looks just like toothpaste. I I was expecting it to look like watery or something because it says it is. It's just like toothpaste, toothpaste and mouthwash all in one. But the only thing, if you tear off the whole label on the side, then you just have this. Oh, so yes. I don't know about you guys, but I like to have my labels on still because I don't know. I'll know what it is. I don't want to write it with a Sharpie. That's so tacky. <laughs> it looks like I reused the stuff. Like we're going to move on to the next. But Colgate two in one toothpaste and mouthwash. So this one is the satin lifters whitening. And this one is, I don't even remember anymore because she took the label <laughs> off. It's some other little toothpaste or someone's for Tinky Man, Colgate Kids um, toothpaste. He likes to brush his teeth. Everybody should have good smelling so breath. As we was talking about dry feet, I told you guys. Dry elbows. They don't have one of these for the elbows. But if they do and I come across one, you best believe I'm getting enough for you. All right? Because there's no reason that your elbow should feel like that. I but try, I got I these from the Dollar Tree. These are moisturizing socks. One size fits Ooh, all. Like Hydrates, socks. softens, and smooths. So basically you want to clean your feet and make sure that they clean. You don't want you to put no dirty feet up in here. That's gross. <laughs> you know how I feel about feet. They're gross. And then you want to dry them. Mm -mm. <laughs> Then you want to dry them off, and then there you put these little socks on them. They're like little socks, and you can wear for 20 to 30 minutes. And they're moisturizing socks, so I best to be wearing these every day. They only had three packs left. They ain't for you. No, they're for me. And you only get one pair, so I'm definitely going to try this out because I'm hoping in my heart of hearts that it works for my dry feet. I mean, you could stretch it out. It could be like a sleeve to warm your heart from your elbows. You could use that, <laughs> yeah. For a dollar. Make me hot. Make me hot now. I'm saying, I need toothpicks at all times. Dental floss, these are the ones, floss picks. Oh, I hate when food gets stuck in my empty spaces, meaning the teeth that used to be there that are no longer there. I need this at all times. Yeah, well finally, I finally seen these. I found these, I mean, I was trying to find, I was actually really trying to find the Kiss um, fingernails, um, press on nails. Oh, those ones? Yeah, but I have not seen them. Only Everybody's been on YouTube talking about they've gotten the Kiss um, press on nails. I've never, ever, 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 ever seen those. But they do have these peel off removable gel dresses, and they're by Kiss. They have like a whole mess load of them today. And I was like, I'm going to get these. I don't know why I'd be getting stuff that I'm not going to use, but these I will use, hopefully. But I did get them to put on Mumsy's nails, her natural nails, just to give her, you know, a little pizzazz, you know, a little <laughs> fanciness in her nails, because of course I cannot put fake nails on her, and I wouldn't want to. But I thought these would be pretty cool to put on her nails and dress them up. So we're going to show you real quick which oh, ones we Alex. got. I know you do. That's why I got them. So these are what they look like. And these are just the nail dress ups. And they're supposed to be like a gel coating. So they say they last up to two weeks. So if you don't have long nails or you don't want long nails, you can definitely use them. But they have the full nails um, shape. So you, you can cover up either your full nail or you can just give yourself like a little mani. Um, a manicure and you'll have like the French nail designs at the bottom. So as you can see, there are two different sizes. There's the... Um, there's the full nail and then there's the French part of the nail so you can choose either one but they both they they all come with emery board and the wooden stick I'm not really sure what you call those but either way these are really cute and they're just um, only gel strips with peel off removal so you could definitely just easily peel these off I think these ones are my favorite because the design is so pretty and I love the bright colors but definitely I got these ones for Mumsy because she loves everything galaxy and I'll probably put the short ones on her like the little piece right here because it'll fit her nail perfectly i won't really have to do much so yes and that's pizzazz. pizzazz on 
on your nail, honey. Possessed. And then the last so, items that I got from the Dollar Tree are for my buddy right okay. here. You know, I surprised her again. This time I got her some more of this clay dough. The first one that we got a couple of weeks ago, right? She didn't really like it. She said it was kind of oily and it really didn't stick too well together. So I seen this one. This is you get more variety for your money. You get eight different colors and they all have a little container and it's just amazing like you're getting all of these little colors for a dollar they give you a coloring chart on the back but i like the fact that you get eight of them they're not all big let me see they're like a nice medium size. They're, right. They're like a nice medium size. You get eight different colors. You have a container. So you get a lot for your money for this one right here. But they also do have sold separately the dough shapers. There's 20 in a pack. And you can make yourself all kind of little animals like turtles, crabs, ducks. Um, They have scissors, radios you can do, and all kind of things with these. So these are really great crafts to keep the kids occupied. And I know Mumsy loves to do crafts. So I said, well, for a dollar... Make me help. It doesn't hurt to give it a try. Now, we did get a couple of things from the 99 cents only store. I remember telling you guys that the 99 cents store has things for a quarter because it's the end of season. You see these items that are for your garden and you just look at them and you're like, oh, them things look ugly. Like, what am I supposed to do with that, right? Because it did look ugly, didn't it? When I bought it, it really, really did look ugly when I first bought it. But then I had spray paint. And you guys know spray paint does a world of color. So, of course, this did not come with this. These are just little faux plants that I purchased from Ikea. I love Ikea. We love Ikea, right? Yes. Look, you see her face? Like, we love Ikea, huh? I like the furniture store, too. Oh, and she loves AFW, American Furniture Warehouse, because they just like to be in there. I don't know what it is, but they love the furniture store. They always like, let's go to the furniture store. And I'd be like, we don't even need no furniture no more. But they love to go there. But we love Ikea because it's just a different scenery. You can, like, just look at different stuff. I'm not saying I'm a big fan of their furniture because it's kind of cheaply made and then it's small. But I love their decor. So the rooms are pretty, too. The way they put things together yeah. is really pretty. So some things are really nice but i love stuff like this because i'm a plant killer i don't really i'm not able to keep plants around me for too long so this kind of stuff comes in handy so i went back to get a few more of these because i've had some of these for these so i got these for a quarter i have three of them actually and i did a video on instagram showing how i spray painted them down so it was this really ugly color um oh, geez. it is i got it on the bottom right here girl it was like a um Oh. It was like a like grayish, a, darkish, brownish. Yeah, it was like grayish, brownish. It was really, really ugly. Is this any, any ugly color you could think of. Yes. And it was 25 cents. And I was like looking at them. Then I was like, you know what? I'm gonna get these. Cause I can make this pop. So I brought them home and I sprayed them down. Bedazzled. I don't want to bedazzle these. No, like Bedazzled them. Oh, I spray. bedazzled them by spraying them? Yes. And they look much better, right? Oh. So I definitely would suggest if you see some ugly stuff, <laughs> just just get it and repurpose it, okay? And make it pizzazz. And make it pizzazz. So that's what I did with these, and then I just... Pop it in. Cute, right? I mean, I'm saying, this looks like it's worth more than 25 cents. Oh, they have Buddhas. Like, my whole house is full of Buddhas. And I really don't need any more. But for a dollar... <laughs> You can't beat that, right? Nah. He was only 99 cents. Mm -hmm. He cute. Right? Happy? Yes. yes. But I seen this. And he, and he was not silver. Well, he was not. He was blue, right? No, he was like this ugly color, like oh. crappy gray. Oof. He was like this nasty. He looked like, you know what this, you know what this is for, actually? What? This is for a fish tank. <gasps> Or you can use it for your garden, too. But he was a dollar. And so I went ahead and sprayed him down just as well. I do have some of those for fish tanks. Mm -hmm. It was about the fish tank stuff. So. And then because um, because Halloween is like next week, I guess, uh, they be acting like it at these, the Dollar Tree and the 99 cents only store. They got their Halloween decor out already. And I thought this was so cute. Day of the Dead headband i'm saying like i'm not gonna wear this for the day of the dead or halloween nice headscarf you know but i'm gonna put it on and act like it's a headband like look that is like a snapchat 
filter, baby. You looking good, hunty. Mm. I mean, it was a dollar. They had like a variety of colors. It is not going to be for Halloween. It's going to be like for whenever. No, it's a headband. How's it going to go <laughs> sideways? Your mind went sideways. Um, what else? Is oh, <laughs> we can never have too many of these USB cords. Um, Because Mumsy got a phone now, I figured let me just rack <laughs> up because I can never have too many of these. And plus, Wuzzle, he always seems to lose I them, know. forget oh them at gosh. his friend's house, right? Always, so sometimes it's like he be leaving his phone there. Yeah, sometimes he be leaving his phone. Then he'll be he'll come up here, mom. You got any more <laughs> cords for the phone, the charging cords? And I'd be like, why? Cause I can't Cause find I mine, or I left mine. All right, and then friends. he'll be like, yeah, he always asks. So I always have these on deck. I only bought two this and time. Then we found another um emoji. Some more. This time. Yeah, there was how many other ones? There were. There was three. Three. I think you should have got the one. She should have got the ones with the glasses because he looked just like her. I like this one. But that's what she liked. So super I'm cute. Who said we was going back? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this is the story that we was talking about. I think this. That's all the stuff. Yeah, I think that. Yeah, yeah. I think that this store is privately owned. It's not a chain store, but she has a lot, like a bunch of stuff for a dollar, right? So Mumsy seen these on the wall, and I was like, they're not a dollar, Mumsy. <laughs> she was like, yes, they down. are. So I went and asked the lady, and she turned to me. She was like, they are a dollar. And I was like, what? It was like, they're a dollar, because she saw you all happy. She heard you. Nay, was I really excited? Yes, and it was like, they're a dollar. I Just love side. a good deal. I, I love a good deal. I'm saying you can't beat that. For brat stuff, this is like original brat stuff. Okay, so these are clothing. Like, come on, man. You can't. You ain't finding this nowhere. If you buy this from the 99 cent only store, it's going to be like $3, right? $2.99. Exactly. Because they're dolls. Oof. Be $5. Mm -hmm. For the Bratz dolls at the 99 cent only First store, they're $5. package like this, they'll be boxed up for $5. Exactly. So we got some clothes. Come on, like she got three outfits and a, a pair of shoes. Pack, which is you get this nice cute outfit and dress and then this little shirt and skirt. I like this one. This one's cute. That one's your favorite? You get this like cowgirl outfit. It has a little purse and it has velcro so you could close it. You get this like skate skater outfit kind of. Super cute for a dollar. I'm saying you are not finding this anywhere. You get some shoes. Yeah, you get shoes with that. Come on, like. So when she said it was a dollar, I was like, what? Okay, so the last thing that we're going to show you and then we're going to let you guys go um, is I'm not really sure if you guys are familiar with a website called Pinch Me, but Pinch Me um, is a products you try products from leading brands for free and then you just basically give your opinion on them you it comes out once a month we match you with products relevant to your lifestyle so it's going to ask you do you have pets do you have children what do you like to do in your spare time do you like to use beauty products you answer all these questions my thing is this answer as much as possible as you can is you pick your samples on sample tuesday choose samples to add to your pinch me box you don't have to add your credit card you don't have to pay for anything you don't have to pay That's for nice. shipping no, and you don't pay for anything. So you just do the survey, and on Tuesdays, you choose the products, your samples that you want to be mailed to you. You're not guaranteed to get every sample, but you're guaranteed to get yourself a nice box full of samples. You give the feedback. You go ahead and you tell about the products that you got. What are your thoughts about it? How did you like it? Would you buy it again? Et cetera, et cetera. You can also share this on social media, and they would really love if you would share it on social media. 100% of it is free all the time. It is not your average box. I have gotten pinch me I think like three times prior to this and I use everything that I get um, I may not use it at that very moment but it also always comes in handy especially because I have so many people that live in my household I have my four kids and my grandson so everything that I get in the box may not be for me but it'll come in handy for somebody You're always yawning in a video Sorry, for real. I do these budget friendly videos because I am budget friendly myself I am very cheap I will use a coupon for anything don't I
Yeah. For clothes. Let me tell y'all. So for this one right here, we got some pretty all right stuff. Like I said, not everything in the box is going to be useful to me, but I do know that this Z quill will be very useful to Tati because you get two liquid caps in here. If it works for you, then good. You didn't um, waste no money. You found out that it worked for you, then you can go out and get yourself some. So that's what these samples are really good for. Some of the Slim Fast. I have three of these and actually never used them. I have three of these, but I love Slim Fast. I just never used the mixed one. Ones, I always use the ones that's already pre-made mm -hmm. and they taste good but the only problem with them is make you use the bathroom thank you she already said it makes you very gassy I did get this in another pinch me box which is the color grabber mm -hmm. I wish I would have had this in my laundry last week somebody did my dad on laundry and my other shirt like this it is not orange. It's it's the same exact shirt, but it got writing on it. Now it looks dull. Like somebody washed it with some dark clothes and my other brand new shirt. And now it just looks a mess. If I would have had this in there, then I would have been fine. Dry but eye relief. So if you um have some dry eyes, you um you have one of these. This is actually a nice, this is dry eye. This is a nice size um box. This is not a sample size. This is actually a full size. So if you got some dry eyes, then definitely check this out. This is good for like doing allergy season, pollen and stuff like this. Now I've never heard of this brand um, because I only use Visine. Yes. Some Orbitz um, peppermint gum. Walter was asking me, did I have some gum the other day? And I was like, no, I didn't. I haven't bought gum in a minute because my teeth. And I guess he always liked his breath to smell good so he could be around them girls. So we're going to definitely give him this. There's 40 in a pack. And this is not a sample pack, but you know what I'm saying? Some Gillette Cool Wave Antiperspirant Deodorant. This is the gel one. So while he is chewing the gum, he can sniff <laughs> under his armpits to make sure that he smells good too for them girls. Okay. And for anybody that has any type of dry hands or elbows, you can always carry this sensitive hands and body lotion by Shea Moisture Organic Shea Butter around with you and you can moisturize them elbows. I'm just saying, you just twist off the top right here, pull back that little paper. So good. I might have to get to somebody to carry in their book bag. What? Why are you just insulting me? I got other kids that go to school, girlfriend. This is a nice, thick consistency. <laughs> And ooh, Stop. this works so well for those dry elbows. So Stop definitely, it. if you have anybody you know that has dry elbows or feet, or feet, definitely give them this. Okay, this is ointment body spray, advanced therapy ointment body spray. Immediately soothes and relieves dry, rough skin all day. Well, what do you know? <sighs> No. Oh, and then, okay. <laughs> oh, that feels good, right? Now, this is what I'm talking about. Ointment body spray. You can use it on your feet. Relieves, soothes, immediately soothes, and relieves rough, dry skin <laughs> all day. I have never in my life seen anything in a spray can. It's new. This is amazing. Now, I wouldn't say carry this with you, but definitely put it alongside your bed at night when you get out the shower and you want to lotion up. You can definitely use this if you have dry elbows or dry feet. Or if your knees are really dry, you can definitely All right. <laughs> spray this on <laughs> And now, okay. these are the things that you get in the pinch me box and everything that I got is definitely coming in handy. I mean, I'm serious, you guys, you can get a, a ton load of stuff and who don't like free stuff like I'm saying, but we also do have one th um, thing, one more thing to show you and Mumsy wanted to say a special thank you to someone who sent her something in the mail. So gonna... Kaya Designs in Lancaster, Pennsylvania. So let me tell y'all, when I opened it up and I was like, oh, oh my God, she knows I love rainbows and unicorns. So I was like, what if this would be for Mumsy, right? So <laughs> I actually opened it up and it is for Mumsy. So you go ahead and say thank you. Thank you, Kaya, for sending me this bag that has unicorns on it. I like it and I'll use it for school for my 
or pencils. It's made by Kaya Designs, um, the Kaya Designs team. And she is on IG, Kaya Designs, K-A-I Designs on IG. And this is very well crafted. You can use it as a wristlet if you want. I really thought it was for me. I had got really excited when I seen it. And I was like, oh, this is so pretty. And then when it said Mumsy, I was like, oh. <laughs> I was like, oh. But the inside is made. I don't care. I love rainbows and I love <laughs> unicorns. So, sure. But, and that's my unicorn on the bed right there. <laughs> but it's very well made because look at it. She has her name inside and it's just very well made with the lining inside. This is a really cute bag. Look at the bottom of Wait, that. Her name? Her name and her company that she has, Kaya Designs. I hope that's how you say it, K Designs. It's probably K Designs. Either way, I do apologize if I'm chopping up the name, but she made this so nice. Like, this is very well made. I'm very impressed. So I'm a little bit jealous, but you know what? I do appreciate you sending this to Mumsy because it came right on time. And she going to be the only one up in her school with a cute little handmade customized unicorn rainbow pencil case okay ain't nobody else gonna have this then all the kids gonna be like oh girl where you get that from you're gonna be like none of your business but you can go on instagram you got a phone and you can check instagram <laughs> okay, for this for much, right? um because ain't nobody else got this you're not gonna find this in nobody's store walmart target justified or nowhere else this was specially made for me that's a little too much to say you can still say it anyway. did your water start learning Oh, it should be like, it should be sad. Everybody be looking at you like, all right, Jana, yeah, okay. <laughs> but yeah, so definitely check out Instagram. This is very well made. And it also has like a little tassel thing right here. So cute. This is adorable. So thank you, Kim, just in time. So we guys, we hope you enjoyed this super duper long Dollar Tree, 99 cents, only store, pinch me, some other random dollar store, <laughs> and a thank you, all wrapped into one, right? <laughs> we love you guys, and we'll see you on a soon-to-come video. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe, thumbs our video up because you love us so much, and turn your notifications on so you never miss a video, and we'll see you in a soon-to-come video, and we love you, and bye. Bye. That's what you're going to put in there, my color pencils. Girl, you better put this up in here for no. you and this. That would be perfect to put this Can in you please here. Just stop it, please. Stop what? The video. I did stop it. No, you didn't. It's still on. Um, you gonna put this in the bag? No. <laughs>